That's a beauty. Birdie. Look at him. That's a good one. Oh, that's awesome. That's a Yo! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Oh, this hunt that you're getting ready to watch. Another river duck hunt. Guys, I found duck hunting. Me and Wade, my best friend of all time, my brother. We have been best friends and brothers for about 20 years. He's on this hunt with me. Uh, this was during guide season, late, 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 late January. When ducks come back open for a week and a half here in Kansas, we get ice on the river and it's awesome. I told myself on this hunt that I was just gonna go with my best friend and have a good time. We all took 20 gauges or four tens. There was four of us and uh, that's what I did. I did not take a GoPro. Um, I shot my limit and then when I was done, I pulled out my phone and I filmed them finishing their limit, filming the dog. And uh, it was the first time in a long time that I hadn't, I just didn't want to worry about a camera. I wanted to enjoy the river like I used to, chill out, uh, reminisce, and, and then film when I was done. So I got my pleasure. <laughs> you, you get where I'm going with this. Sometimes I have to just put down the camera and go hunting and remember how much I love it without having to have a camera on my head. I hope that you guys would understand and agree, you know? Because at the end of the day, I do this on YouTube duck hunting because it's always been my ultimate passion and it grew into this, right? So you have to uh, learn how to keep loving your job and why, you know, the why. Why, you ask yourself why. This is why, this video is why. But before we get going guys, check out the matching duck gear. Yeah, this camo pattern is legit. Guys, use code BOB at checkout. You will save yourself some money and you help me out a ton when you do so. We just dropped a whole line of new apparel, duck calls, all of the shotgun chokes are in stock. Yeah, we got a wood duck call that is bad boy. So if you're a, a, a wooden call type of guy, go grab this. Ducks is always linked down in the description. I'll actually put it at the top of the description in this here video. Remember, use code BOB at checkout. Guys, my podcast is it's popping off. Uh, we just did a, uh, another one with Cole and introducing him to the Ducks Waterfowl team. And uh, anyways, it is linked down below as well. I'm getting ready to give away a few things. We're giving away a two-man hunt over there in September for two lucky guys to come in January. So my spill's over. Let's go. Why yellow? I don't have a GoPro or a uh, camera at all. Old P. Diddy has all my stuff. And late last night, me and the boys, uh, we got Gage, Wade, myself, and Drusev. Uh, we decided to try a duck hunt. It's, uh, this is duck hunt opener, uh, January opener after the split. And uh, we're on the river. Obviously, no clients. Uh, but why we didn't think it was going to be, you know, we, I honestly thought we'd shoot a couple. There's there's a pile of storm girl waders and the beautiful river. Um, I got four ducks. You got three, right? Three, three. Yours floating Wade's over got my four. Foot. Gage's got two. Gadwall Woody's um, hen mallard greenhead. Heck of a uh, mixed bag going on, but I'm gonna try to film a little bit. I definitely shot four ducks, so. I'll film on the old phone and let's watch the boys get after it. Check out the spread. Trying to be gentle, but we shot this stud to the skull. Stud like Woody blowed out too. Well, he's still alive. He's trying to kill him with a finisher. If you guys know, you're just dripping blood, dude. I know. I'm, we want to mount that bird. It's a stud Try muffin. Not to make it worse. Yeah. Well, he pooped, I think. Ooh, nasty. But uh, we're just sitting on the bank, no blind. And this is the uh, this is the spread. What do we bring? Three dozen floaters. Yes. Yes. Three dozen floaters. Two mojos. That mojo keeps spinning this way for some reason. Yeah, don't worry about it. But see this little cut right here. The the river splits. The river's flowing that way, so the ducks have to come close to us, and it's just working out perfect. Um, I really miss these hunts. This these are the hunts me and Wade literally grew up doing. This is what got us addicted to duck hunting. A lot of people ask us all the time, Bob, what's your favorite hunting? This right here, 110%. Yeah, we had probably close to 50 ducks in the decoys before shooting time. Yeah. Like right at it, like just ducks nonstop. We had some right here on our forehead. Oh yeah, oh yeah, right here. 
Is he uh, bleeding out? I think he's about done. But he might be done. That's a good one. Look at this, dude, look at his thick cheek patch He's there. twitching pretty good now. I think I got him this time. What a beauty. All right, let's see if we can shoot something. We've had about a 10 minute lull here. Get ready. Group up top, guys. Nope, there we go. Shoot them, guys. Shoot them, shoot them. No. No. Nice. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. Look at that bear. That you hit that one hard. Yeah, that was nice. Uh, another thing about today, we're all using go 20 down. gauges. I got my SB3 20 gauge. Wade's got, well, you got a Benelli 20 oh, gauge? Nope, SX3. SX3 20 gauge. wife's gun. Your wife's gun. Two up front, two up front. Oh, Allergy. and then whole gauge, he's down there. He's rocking a over and under 410. So small gauge only today. Here they come back. Here we go. Uh, if you guys are liking this so far, I know it's pretty short so far, uh, drop a comment down below, uh, smash the old heart button on here. Uh, this is, this is my, if I could say my roots of where I started, this is it, 100%. And uh, we don't get to hunt the river much anymore because one, I guide all through the season, and, and two, we, we're just not cold during duck season, like November, December. We don't get cold enough to push the ducks to the river, so this is refreshing. Let me tell you what, it's a good buddy hunt. We really needed it. Oh, that storm girl. She's having fun. What you guys got down there? We got two more. Well, I'll show you guys the spread. There's a little stream here. And Joking around, Wade put him there, and I think it actually looks really good. Uh, this is the spread. We got three dozen floaters out. And right here, it's really calm, shallow, not a lot of current. And this spot that we're at, oh, hold on, I gotta fix this mojo. There we go. This spot we're at is a spot me and Wade have always wanted to hunt. Uh, this is actually a warm water discharge. And, um, this never freezes. So historically, the ducks know that this is always open during cold weather when, when the whole river's basically froze. There you go. Well, I tried getting it on camera, but I didn't. I just shot a gaddy. Check her out, him out. Take him. Yep. Pintail, nice, that's a stud pintail. He's got a sprig on him. Nice. Good shot. That was a far shot. Who oh, smoked him? You reach, or you were, reach out there for the him? twenty? You guys hit him at the same yeah, time. Man, Drew tagged him. We, we shot about the same time, so. Well, well let's check out the him. penny. Look at the sprig <laughs> on him. That's a pretty one there. Oh boy. Oh boy. boy Look at old Storm Girl. That completes the old mix bag there. Yeah, Look at that guy. Is. What a beauty. Here. That would be insane. You got your finisher. What a beauty. Look at him. Look at the sprig on him. Oh, my. Yeah, we better keep him. Beauty. Looks like a pheasant. Like got to use the old finisher on the back of the head. Don't wring in their neck if you want to keep them. That's never, a beauty. never used one before. Pinch their bill down to their neck. There's a soft spot where their spine meets their skull. It's where you want to go in. It's the less damage. Is that right? That didn't work for you earlier. You were I know. Like it damn back. sure didn't work for your ass earlier. <laughs> my wood duck's been that's flopping for five wood minutes. Duck I've ever seen in my life. There's no way that it, it scrambles the brain. There's no way they're alive. It's just their body, probably. That's a beauty. Look at him. That's a good one. There. Oh, that's awesome. That's what you want to see is that blood start to Just run out. single by himself. Being a yeah, stud muffin all by himself. Oh. 
Oh, Storm Girl, look how icy she is. How much does Storm weigh? 50 pounds. She's a little girl. She's just a little girl. What a beauty, dude. Absolute stud monkey. Get him. Oh, God, I oh. all three. Anybody shoot anything down here? Down here? Oh, they came out of nowhere, oh, dude. The what the hell? I did not see him coming. Oh, another one up top. Oh. Big swings and misses, but yeah. Or I shot at, I should say. Yeah, you shot at him. I thought you were going to get him. I thought I smoked him on the first one. I did too. I think I shot over him. Where did they just, dude, they just come boom. out of nowhere? Boom. There's another one. Oh, well, as you can see, we're all picked up. We got everything. We're done. What time is it? 8.40. We've been done for every bit of 40 minutes. About an hour. Yeah. I don't think we've shot for about 40 minutes. Uh, but here we go. Old Storm Girl. She did good today. This was awesome. Very much needed buddy hunt. That's for darn sure. Gadwall, one green head. An awesome uh, wood duck. Hopefully he's saveable. And the stud, stud pintail, check, the, check out the sprig on him. Gadwall, one widgeon, check him out. Uh, but that was amazing. We haven't got to do that in a long time. Nope. It's been forever. Long time. Year, I mean, I've been a river hunted for a while. I bet you it's been a good river hunt. Uh, eight years, I don't know. I grew good. up hunting the river and haven't been back on it for, yeah. Probably eight years. There we are. Huh. Takes me back to that day. Uh, what an awesome hunt. I wish I would have had P Diddy or someone to operate the big camera. Um, so I still could have left my GoPro at home and shot my gun still, finished my limit out. Um, but man, what a hunt. Um, it felt good getting down on the river with Wade and the boys. Uh, last year, actually, yeah, last year me and Wade were able uh, to do a morning hunt, a field duck hunt, which was amazing. It was actually Judge's, uh, my dog Judge, that was his first duck hunt with, you know, me and him together, which was really special. Um, so whenever we, me and Wade can get out and hunt together, um, anytime, no matter if it's ducks, pigeons, dove, uh, speaking of dove, I got all of my stuff ready to go. I got all of the spinners, brand new batteries in them. I'm so ready. Couple days, couple days, few days, few days. September 1st, we'll be kicking butt. Old rooster, he's a cocky guy. But with dove hunting season almost here, uh, the north wind has been here as well, which is amazing. Uh, hopefully it sticks around. The forecast says it's going to be back in the hundreds in like a handful of days, uh, which is good because that means we will hold the dove. It seems like every September 1st uh, opener is really good and then the you know handful of days go by and uh, we get a huge cool off, huge cool off, and it just pushes the dove south. I don't think that's going to happen this year. I think that this is going to be some of the best dove hunting that I've experienced here at home in a long time. We have dove freaking everywhere. And I mean everywhere. The other day, uh, the last video, the pigeon hunt, uh, where we shot 82, uh, just three of us, uh, we decoyed over 200 dove uh, easily. I mean decoyed, decoyed, not flying by, landing in the pigeon spread right by the spinners over 200 probably 300 uh to be really honest and the field that we were hunting was a pigeon feed for whatever reason i don't know it was just a dist field just dirt there wasn't a there was zero food in there oh yeah buddy and i don't i still don't know why so many dove were there but geez they're everywhere i've been scouting in the mornings they're everywhere so get out there do your scouting remember guys to purchase all your licensing Make sure you're good to go. Hip stamps, federal stamp needs to be signed on your person at all times if you are hunting migratory game. 
which dove is a migratory bird, just like a crane, just like a goose, just like a duck. But be safe out there. Uh, we will be pumping out the dove hunts here shortly. A couple in mind is gonna be a 410 uh, video that I'm gonna do. The silencer, first time ever using a silencer on dove. They're fast, it'll be pretty tough, but I'm excited. Thank you all for being here, but until next time.